Okay guys, so before this video starts, I just want to keep in mind that this is a re-upload of a previous video that I made weeks ago. I don't remember the exact date, but anyways, I realized that in the original video that there was like this weird pause. I was meant to like edit that stuff out and it was just really awkward. Like I looked like CGI Superman in Justice League. So I cut that all off and made this better version of the video that I was meant to make. So yeah, this is a re-upload. Thank you guys. Okay, so I'm just gonna make this video with the front face camera because that way I can see how the video is. So I don't have to like film it and then realize, yeah, this is a crappy angle. So this is how it's gonna be. If the quality's not as good, I apologize. This is just how it's gonna be for me personally. All right, so this is kind of a different kind of video. I didn't know if I was gonna make this or not, but I'm gonna be honest. I really don't know what else to film, so this is one thing that I'm gonna do just to do it. For those who don't know, for my senior year, I joined the men's choir in my high school, and so I wanted to try something different. I knew it was my last year, and I, I just graduated for the context of this video, and I thought it'd be a good experience, and it wasn't all that bad, but it was mainly negative. And this isn't like an exposed video, like I'm not gonna be like all crying and stuff, like I'm still sad about it. I mean, I was sad about it at the time, but now I'm not because I graduated, I, I have a good thing coming. I'm going to college, go Big E, you know what I'm saying. All right, let me start off with the positives of the men's choir. So, I made some very good friends in the men's choir. I'm gonna shout them out right now, actually. Trey, Cliff, Micah, Jacob. Two Jasons, John Mark, and Ben. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty much it. Um, yeah, I didn't make a lot of friends except for those guys. So thanks for being nice to me, guys. I appreciate it. So, <laughs> oh my God, this video is going to be very interesting. Okay, so what? what's the first negative I'm going to talk about today? What's the first negative? Um, I think mainly the popular kids. Um, they always seem nice, but to me, they weren't, and I didn't really care personally, they just took it too seriously, so, oh, that's, that's another negative. The kids took the choir stuff way, way too seriously. One kid, I won't name him, but me and the basses, I was in, I was, a, I'm a baritone, so I was in the bass group, we this one guy, he was a tenor. And so, I don't know why, he he has this mentality where he thought he was better than everybody. And people like that just really piss me off. I'm just gonna be honest right there. And so, yeah, I didn't really like him that much and because he was kind of a jerk. And so he had this full on meltdown during one of our rehearsals for the fall concert, calling us idiots, mainly the basses calling me and my friends idiots because apparently we didn't know what we were doing. Clearly we did know what we were doing. We were practicing our verses for our song, keeping quiet, and not have a full on meltdown during rehearsal. Okay, listen, I don't know if this guy will even watch this video. I kind of hope he does because you need to understand that having meltdowns like that it's not gonna get you anywhere. It just proves that you're not a good guy. If you have a job, this is business. If you go like that, you're, you're gonna have a really bad resume. People are not gonna wanna hire you. It's common sense. They just take it too seriously, you know what I mean? I felt like, I felt weird. Cause like, at that point, I was just questioning why I joined choir in the first place. Cause like, I just went there to have fun and like sing not worry about having the anxiety of like other people you know what I mean like it was it was weird that was one thing I had seriously bad anxiety man because oh man it was bad because of the other kids like I felt I knew I had a good voice I knew I had a good voice it's just I felt like other people were better than me at the time which clearly now I don't really think of it anymore.
but yeah, it was kind of not good for me, but you know, honestly, that's something you really should not be feeling if you're in choir, especially in high school choir where it doesn't even really matter. I mean, it's not making me like quit choir com completely. I'm in my church choir currently and I'm actually joining some choir. I forget what the name was, but I'm doing it in EKU when I join the classes. So yeah, I'm doing that. I'm signed up for that. So I'm looking forward to that. There was one thing. So I planned on auditioning for the uh, spring musical. It was the drowsy chaperone. And I wasn't really, <laughs> it was nobody's fault, but I thought it was something I should probably add up. I was gonna audition for it. But then I realized that same week, my EKU audition for the music department, excuse me, my EKU audition for the music, music department was on that same week. And like, I was gonna do it, but at the same time, I had no idea what I was doing. I knew I wasn't prepared for the audition. And so I went on a ski trip that weekend because it was my birthday. My youth group, we went to a ski trip. The Sunday morning, I, like, I was worried because like, I was worried what my parents were gonna say if I didn't want to audition anymore. And like, since I told them they didn't really care, they thought it was okay. And so at that point I knew EKU was more important than the spring musical and Keep in mind, this was like all before the pandemic and everything. This was like in February. So we had no idea that the pandemic was even happening. And so, yeah, that would have been worse if I actually auditioned and then I got a role and then got canceled. That same morning, I was having anxiety about it. And also, I found out that morning that this girl I liked had a boyfriend. And so I was just very upset that morning. I did not want to talk to anybody. I just wanted to go back home. I was listening to the 1975, and I'll tell you, it worked. It really worked. Music can really help you out, man. Okay, so yeah, this video is kind of a weird kind of video. I didn't really expect to make this, but uh, overall, this is my honest review of high school choir in general. If I could take advice, it would be do not join on senior year. I'd recommend joining freshman year if you're really into it. If you're really into theater in general, I'd go for it. But I'm not really a theater guy. I'm more of a alternative songwriting band type of guy, even though I never really joined band. You know what I mean. I mean, you know me. You know what I'm into. That's what I was into. But I'm glad I joined, you know? Glad I got the experience. So, Thanks for watching.